Hey, John. I, I know, obviously, Jeff was talking about the, the defense in the last game. Where, where are you guys as a group trying to reset here coming into this, this second game against the Panthers? I think for our group, it, it all comes down to competitiveness in, in those 50-50 battles, those puck battles on the walls coming out of our zone and, and down low in the corners. We've got to do a better job of winning those and spending less time in our defensive zone, which I think that's exactly where it starts, is winning those little battles and moving the puck up to the forwards and, and then winning their battles on the walls and then we transition quickly and we're out of our end. And then, you know, how much are you guys kind of drawn on the response that you had against Columbus to, to come back and, and just kind of give the same effort to, that, you, that you were able to put together last weekend in Detroit? Yeah, we, we've been able to overcome a little bit of adversity at times throughout the season. When, when we kind of have a down game, we come back and, and respond. So we're looking to uh, do the same tonight. And I see your hat. Are you uh, are you going to be following opening day from from back here uh, on the road today? Yeah, we'll be checking the scores for sure. Thanks. Next up, Trevor Thompson, Valley Sports Detroit. Hey, John, how big of a baseball fan or a Tigers fan are you? Um, I, I guess as big as you can be as a hockey player. Um, I went to a bunch of games as a kid. Um, it was fun growing up in Michigan in the early 2000s. They had some good teams there, some good runs. So um, definitely watching and um, following closely. Well, good luck to them. Good luck to you guys tonight. What makes defending against Florida so tough from your perspective? They're a well-coached team. They're all on the same page. And, and when pucks pop out of our zone, they're ready to come right back down your throat quickly. And their D don't waste any time. They pump it right back up to their forwards, and they're right back down on you. So I think they transition really well. I think they're probably the one of the best rush teams off the league. they got some guys who can, you know, make space for themselves off the rush, hit late guys, um, make some plays. So it's definitely something we want to try to eliminate is, is their rush game. So we'll try to work to grind them in the offensive zone so they don't have the energy to get up the ice and, and play off the rush. So that's the biggest key then to take away what they want to do and really have your game work the way you want it to. What you just said there, take away. Yeah, exactly. I think for us, it's about spending more time in the offensive zone, grinding them, making it a more difficult game for them. They want to spend as little time as, as possible in their D zone. They want to come back in and be out quick and, and get back in on the rush. So we got to stand over pucks in the offensive zone, make good decisions, not throw it away, and, and that would be the difference tonight. Thanks, John. Thanks, Trevor. That's it for us this morning. Thanks, everyone.